crashed a biker party. And I know what you're thinking, why? Well, we know we really don't fit in with the biker demographic, and that's okay. Something we learned a while ago is that it's super easy to gravitate towards people who think and look very similar to the way we think and look. So we said, enough of that, we need to meet people who aren't like us. And as luck would have it, we recently just purchased a tuk-tuk and it's technically registered as a motorcycle. Sarah even took the driving test in it. This gave us the perfect excuse to go crash a biker party. Thanks to BetterHelp to sponsoring this video. Stick around to learn how to save 10% on your first month. Get in, going bike night. She almost took out that back box. If you think that you can handle this, then you better know you're messing with Savages, savages, we're savages. If you think that you can handle this, you gotta know who you've been messing with. Savages, savages. Tonight's bike night at a local barbecue place here in town. And tonight we're gonna crash that bike night. We called ahead and they said, no specific motorcycle is required. Just come with whatever you've got. So we are. But first, we've gotta go pick up our friends just down the street and then we're all gonna head over to barbecue night. Let's go. Oops, this my ear. <laughs> Let's go. So since our last video, we've gotten better. Well, Sarah's gotten better. We both have gotten better. We know what the clutch is and what it does now. Which is good. A lot of trial and error, but we're doing it. We're fun. Yeah. every Wednesday and it always looks like fun. It so. is every Wednesday, yeah. man. These guys are great. Yeah. yeah. The food's good, the company's good, the music's good, and the beer's cold. Y'all yeah. <laughs> <laughs> gonna stop by. Appreciate yeah. the company. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> There's a bunch of bikers surrounding the Tuk Tuk right now. Oh, no. 
I don't know what we need it for. You can use it for beer run. Uh, Does it got a radio in it? There's a GoPro, it's video on us. Yeah. You ever take this thing off any sweet jumps? Yeah. Thank you. Unless I have a lot of It's a deluxe. We do all photos for the public. That place here for a bottle of whiskey or a fire extinguisher, I'm not sure which. You know what this looks like, Jack? An insurance band nightmare? Went out of fast and go. It's just got go and stop. The register's 80. Probably kilometers. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> All right. So. Today, we want to take a quick second here to talk to you about something that means a lot to both of us. Things aren't always as they seem on the surface, and that's especially true with the motorcycle group that we're hanging out with at the barbecue place in this video. We motorcycle guys have a tendency to be really like rough and they look kind of intimidating, but then we kind of found out that they're actually really nice guys and we had a lot of fun. And that's sort of in line with today's sponsor of the video, which is BetterHelp. And if you're not familiar with who BetterHelp is, it is a online, virtual mental health care professional platform. If you are like us and you are struggling with mental health care, Chris and I both struggled extensively with anxiety and depression um, behind the scenes. It's something you don't see on YouTube or Instagram because we keep that side of our lives private, not because we want to be dishonest, but because it's really tricky to work through those things. And we can say that finding a therapist is one of the best things we've done for ourselves. No matter where you are, if you travel full time or if you're home with the kids and getting out to go see a therapist in person is just too time consuming. You can have your therapy sessions on the couch, in a van, on a plane, well actually probably not on a plane, but just about anywhere else you could think of, you can see a regular study, the same therapist over and over every week. Build that relationship just like you would in person. And if you're like us, one of the things that holds you back from seeking out a mental health care professional is the cost. So today we do have 10% off for your first month with BetterHelp. Go to betterhelp.com slash Chris and Sarah and get 10% off. So we encourage you to take care of your mental health. It's one of the best things you can do. All right, now back to the video. <laughs> I'll take that one. <laughs> this down, all you're going to do is you're crank it. At the same time? Hold that down. Near as cool as the rest of them. 
of these guys, they all have like legit vibes and then we roll in. We parked it like front and center. I didn't even park it in the lines right. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about this koozie that you got. It was really special. Uh, just sitting there drinking a, a Miller Lite and he came up and he's like, ma'am, I don't want your beer to get cold. We can't have that, can we? So he handed me a koozie. It was very sweet. I, was, I feel special. <laughs> <laughs> This is fun, I'm not stopping. Yeah. I saw one turning point, I was like, well, that's gone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I appreciate cool. you guys. Yeah, no, yeah, thanks for doing that. Let it grab us. Onye. Josiah. Josiah. Sarah. Sarah. Chris. Chris, I forgot yeah. all your names. Yeah, Chris. Yes, I remember Chris. that one. Yes, Chris. Yeah. Yeah. I'm in sales, so it's always, hey, buddy. So, if you're like us, there's a stigma about bikers that they're really rough, really rough, and not very welcoming, kind of, you know, they just do their own thing. These guys were so nice. Everybody we met, we met a lot of people that we met, Trek and Tony and, I don't remember very well, but Trek and Tony really stood out. <laughs> Tony actually owns the place and Trek's out there directing traffic tonight. But everybody's been so nice, and in fact, They've all been really interested in the little tuk-tuk because they know it's registered as a motorcycle. Like, yeah, we saw it. We saw the license plate. We know you're a motorcycle. And they just don't know what to do with it. And so they've approached us and been talking. It's pretty fun. <laughs> so, not, our, not our usual demographic. I mean, obviously. <laughs> but they've been so great. Everybody's been really welcoming. Revin, Revin, Revin. the scenes and extra content, you can head on over to our Patreon community. Otherwise, be sure to follow on Instagram or like and subscribe here. It really helps creators like us.